hello and welcome and welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is april and this is april's fresh start budgets where money and budgeting doesn't have to be intimidating and every day is a new opportunity to make a fresh start with financial decisions that'll help you win with money so today we are going to be doing a savings challenge stuffing my husband gets a bonus check every march and september so his last bonus check was in september and he knew when he got that bonus check that he wanted to take some time off after his busy season which is usually before thanksgiving to the new year so after the new year he took a week off of work and he took it unpaid so in september when he got his last bonus check we set aside a thousand dollars to make up for that one week of unpaid and it actually only needed to be the only difference in his check was actually about um, $301. So I have the extra 301 that we did not use of that $1,000 to make up for the difference between his normal paycheck and what he actually got paid. So I have the extra $301 here that we did not use from putting aside the money for the bonus check. And we are going to do some savings challenges with that money today. So let's count it and make sure we have the full amount. We have 51, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 301. All right. So how are you guys doing today? I hope everybody is staying warm. I hope nobody got hit too hard with snow. We definitely got a lot of snow here in Ohio, but we're kind of used to that by now. All right, so one thing that I did want to start with you guys is I wanted to start this savings challenge where it's color in the states. So I'm hoping that you guys can comment down below what state you are watching me from. If you are watching me from an international location, if you can comment that as well. And then in future savings challenges, I will save the amount for the state that you are watching from. Or if you are an international viewer, I will save $10 for inter each international viewer from a different, that's from each country. So comment down below what state you're watching me from or what country you're watching me from. And let's start saving some money in this. The other savings challenge that I would like to start is this crossword search. So these are the words that we're looking for. If you comment down below the word that you find, I will save $5 for each one that you guys comment. I'll also screenshot this so that it'll be a little bit easier to see. And then these savings challenges came in this binder from Artwork by Kevin on Etsy, and I'll have him linked down below. So comment the state that you're watching from, the country you're watching from, and the word that you find in the word search. Okay, so let's get started on our savings challenges. I do have some other news in the savings challenge front. My husband, so the, one of the savings challenges that I have been doing regularly is the savings challenge that I created, this Happy New Year 2024 savings challenge. We were saving to go to an Igloo experience next Saturday. And as it turns out, my husband has twice a year, he has a meeting at work that he cannot miss. And it's in the evening times on Saturdays. And it just so happens to be next Saturday. So we had to reschedule our, our Igloo experience. They didn't have any availability in the next two weeks. So we needed to get together with the other people that we're going with and talk about when we're having it. I'm really disappointed, but you know what, no matter what, we will finish the savings challenge today. I have an IOU of 14 and then we're gonna scratch this one off and we will be done. We will have saved the $300 for it. So I have this earmarked for that. So let's go ahead and we know we owe 14 and let's scratch and see what this is. This is two. Okay, so we owe a total of 16. And believe it or not, guys, this is the first savings challenge that I am finishing on my channel. I am so excited about that. All right, so we have $16. So we have 5, 10, 15, and 16. And let me get the 
envelope for that. All right, so we're gonna add that to it and we should have the full 300. Let's see if we do. All my money is kind of convoluted here. Okay, so let's see if we have it. We have 100, 50, 200, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 300. We did it. We have finished our first savings challenge. And we did it in the new year. We did it before our goal date. Unfortunately, the goal date got moved, but that is okay because when we do go to this, we have it. Awesome, guys. Thank you so much for doing this with me and for cheering me on to finish this savings challenge. All right, so I'm going to pull this one out and put it in the completed box. And then we will move on to our next savings challenge. All right, let's do this savings challenge, the January one. We are a little behind on that one. So let's roll a dice and see how many of these we can do today. Four, okay, so let's do, let's do the 20, the 20, so that's 40. And then we will do the, 35 and the five, so that's 40. And then this is 40, so I owe total $80. So let's do 50, 70, and 80. All right, awesome. So, so far this one has in it Fifty, seventy, ninety, one ten, one thirty, one fifty, one seventy, one eighty, one eighty five, one ninety, one ninety five. Okay, non ninety five, and we're working our way towards five hundred. This one is from the Honeydew Hive. I will have this link down below as well. All right, let's do this one. This is from Save with Judy. We have. Um, five dollars for each week. We're gonna go ahead since we're almost at February. We're gonna roll a dice and see how many we are going to be able to complete for February. Five. We're gonna be able to do all five for February. All right. So let's get twenty-five added to this. So we're ahead of the game on this one. That's awesome. Actually, you know what? I want to color those hearts in with a red to make it more festive. Okay, so we are caught up on that one. We have our $25, we'll put that in here. And we don't need to play this one again until March, actually. So we're ahead of the game on this one. And I'll have Save with Judy linked down below. She has an awesome channel. I believe she still will have this in some of her videos if you guys would like to download it for free. All right, let's do this one with Jan with Country Girl Budgets. And let's see how many of these we're going to complete today. Let's do two of them. All right, so we can do, let's do the 15 and the 5 for 20. OK, 
Okay. All right. Willy Wonka. Let's see. How many of these are we going to be able to do today? So these are each $20. And I will roll the dice and we'll see how many of these we're going to finish. Four. So this is a total of $20, $40, 60 $80. All right. So we've got our 50 70 80 all right, let's see how much we have in the Wonka so far. This one is from Sons and Roses. I'll have her channel link down below as well. Okay. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 255, 260. $260 saved in Wonka. And the total goal amount here is going to be $1,260. So we're just $1,000 away from that. And we're moving right along. Awesome. All right. So we are going to do my son's birthday challenge. This is for my oldest son, Randy, who is 20. He'll be 21 in May. We are saving upwards of $300 to go towards his flight to California. He's going to go visit a friend for his birthday present. This is part of it. So let's roll the dice and see how many of these we can complete today. How much do we have left? Let's check on that. We have 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80 dollars left. All right, so let's see. We're going to do five. Awesome. All right, so let me get my yellow. Let's see if we can do, we said we had 80 left. Let's see if we can finish with this one. We'll do 20 there, 20 there, 20 there. So that's 60 and three, we need two more. So let's do some tens. So we'll do that one and that one. All right. So that is the 80, and that is all five of those. Let's see how much we have towards that one. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20. 120 towards Randy's birthday savings challenge. Excellent. So one of the other savings challenges that I'm doing, I was watching a video and somebody commented that they would like to do a 100 envelope challenge, but they just didn't have the money to do that. And trust me, I totally get it with doing other savings challenges, or if you're just starting with budgeting, doing any sort of savings challenge is super tough. But what I wanted to show any everybody is that no matter what you're starting with, even if it is a single cent you can save. So I'm doing a penny challenge. You guys may have seen some of my sh shorts. They I'm starting with one day. Day one is one penny. Day two is two pennies. And I don't know if I'm going to stop at 100 days. If I stop at 100 days, adding one penny every day, we will have $50 and 50 cents after 100 days. And that is an excellent, excellent start to saving if you have never done a savings challenge before. And you can literally find change in your pockets, your couch, laundry, on the street, whatever you need to do in order to start this. I just want to show everybody that even if you don't have a whole dollar to start with, you can start saving. Every literal penny counts. So if you haven't seen those, I have a playlist of shorts on my channel. Go ahead and check those out and follow along with me. Go ahead and start saving yourself. And don't forget to comment down below with your state or country that you are watching from and the word that you found in the word search. Until next time, guys, thank you so much for watching. Have a great night. Bye-bye.